I'll just figure out and make a video on how to move the LG Optimus Dynamic without a computer and we're gonna do that by using two apps so I'm gonna get started and show you how to do that okay first we need to go to the Play Store and download an app called Ministro 2 and just follow my steps and right here and I'll show you how to do that just click on Ministro 2 and hit install and let that do its thing and I'll show you the next step Okay, now we're going to go download the LG Noob tool, and that will allow us to root the device. Which, for me, I'm just going to paste it, but for y'all, the link will be in the description down below. And I'm just going to download it and start like any other app. And you can follow along. Just hit install, let it install. You hit open. And if you notice, it goes into the Ministro app. And you just hit OK. Um, and let it load. And this will root your device but we got another step after this and we're going to have to install super user off the play store before we can actually give permission to any root apps and you just let this root the device it's this is really simple if you think about it And this whole video proves that you can root the LG Optimus Dynamic without a computer in under 7 minutes. So, it's kind of helpful to know. <laughs> and I'm working on making another video on how to put clockwork and how to one click root this phone all in one. I'm working on that video right now. The computer's not really agreeing with me to make the video, but I'm I'm gonna make it work. <laughs> okay, now we have to install the SU binary and you just basically hit yes, you let that do its thing and the SU binary was installed to finish booting super user app needs to be installed so we have to go over to the play store and download the super user app
just follow my steps and download the Supia app. It's very simple as well. Just hit install and accept. Let that install. Okay, now that we have the installed, I want to prove that the root has worked. And we do that. Um, there's an app called Root Checker. And I'm going to download that and show you that I have root permission on this phone now. And that's why I'm just going to show you. It's a pretty cool app. It tells you whether you have root or not, if it was accessible or not pretty much. So I'm going to show y'all that it works. Let that install as well. You just hit open and this will show us whether the root has worked or not. Just hit verify root and give it like a minute or less. See, it asks for permission. I gave it permission and it works. So this device is fully rooted now and we can use it with any root app. So Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And that's all I have to say.